Hey, that's right, it's Bella. I'm back with another makeup-related video for you guys. So this is gonna be like a get ready with me. Since yesterday, we had our moving up ceremony, so I really want to share with you guys the look that I decided to go for. So this is the look, and I really wanted to go for that fresh and natural-looking makeup look just because I didn't really want to go heavy on my makeup during our moving up ceremony since it's lang siya because it's hot in the venue. Namin. But anyway, if you're new to my channel, Channel. Hi, my name is Bella. I'm a 16-year-old Filipina YouTuber who makes beauty and lifestyle videos. So make sure to subscribe to be part of the hashtag BellaFam. And to get notified whenever I upload a new video, make sure to click the bell button right beside the subscribe button. So yeah, without further ado, let's just get started. Okay, first things first, headband. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna take my micellar water. Take off the excess makeup from yesterday. Because yesterday yung um, moving up namin. And I think I still have some mascara on. Because <laughs> mascara is super hard to take off. So yeah, I'm just. Meron pa nga. <laughs> oh my gulay. That's why minsan yung eye bags ko super, super dark na. It's because of the excess of mascara from the day before. So make sure to take that off. Okay, I'm now done removing the excess makeup. It's mainly on um, mascara. But um, now I'm gonna take my lip balm, which is from Laneige or Laneige. I don't know how to pronounce this. But um, I'm gonna moisturize my lips because my lips right now are chapped, like as always. <laughs> okay, so I'm done with lip balm. Now it's time to moisturize my face as well because my forehead has been dry for the past few days. You guys can use any hydrating toner so that you won't have any dry patches on your face. Because that's what happened to my forehead ko So I really need to moisturize even though um, I'm oily. Now that we are done with the toner, now let's move on to primer. So I'll be using this Professional from Benefit. And I really love this one because it really minimizes the pores. I mean the visible pores. Really need that on my cheeks, also the nose, so so forehead. <laughs> okay, next is foundation. So I'll be using this Fit Me Matte and Poreless Liquid Foundation from Maybelline. Oh, wait, I forgot my sponge. Oh wait, got my sponge. Okay, so konti lang ilalagay ko. Maybe there. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> Actually, that's too much, but you know, I can't waste my foundation. So I'll put it on my forehead, my cheeks, basically all over my face. Ah, so brown up my foundation. So I'll be blending it with a damp sponge. By the way, for this look, I'm going for like a natural look. So I won't go crazy on like the eyeshadow or I won't even put eyeshadow later on. Of course, you have to blend the foundation on your neck as well para pantay ng kulay. Okay, so I'm now done blending my foundation. Now it is time for concealer. I cannot. Yeah, naman. I keep on dropping things. But anyway, I cannot skip concealer just because my eye bags are getting worse and worse. You guys know that. And of course, moving up, I don't want them to see my really dark eye bags. So concealer. <laughs> so this is my favorite, which is the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. And the shade medium. And oh, by the way, um, my shade's foundation is 220. I mean, and like every makeup tutorial that I do, I always use this um, concealer. Just because I really like the coverage. And it's like the coverage that my eye bags need. Now it's time to blend. Because um, it's easy to set the concealer. Na to. So the excess I put in the lid since I have um, some discolorations. Now it is time to set my concealer and my foundation with this Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Powder. <laughs> I'm so sorry for the lighting because the weather right now is not cooperating with me. Because it's sunny and then now it's sunny and then it's sunny and it's sunny and So I'm, I really apologize. Okay, so I got my brushes here. And I'm gonna take this Real Techniques powder brush. I think that's what it's called. Buffing brush. Okay. So I'm just gonna set everything. And I'm gonna set yung cheeks ko just because I'm gonna put um cream contour later on. So yung tizong muna yung sineset ko. Okay, now that I'm done setting my base, now it's time for the eyebrows. 
Anjan ka na naman, ba't di ko maiwasan? Oh my gosh, na-alasas na naman ako. Because I keep on playing that song on repeat. Like, <laughs> someone stop me. But anyway, for my brows, I'll be using this Brow Cream Gel from Benefit. And I'm in the shade number 5. So this is like the second to the last, the darkest shade. So I'm just gonna take my brush and fill in my eyebrows. But when I fill in my brows naman, I don't go crazy. Because um, thick na naman yung eyebrows ko. So I don't really have to fill it in that much. Only yung mga sparse areas. Kasi hindi rin masyado pantay yung eyebrows ko. Like, I like this one better. <laughs> yup, that is it for this eyebrow. Now I'm just gonna blend. Now it's time for this one. Okay, now I'm done with my eyebrows. That's it. It's super simple. Okay, as I said a while ago, I won't be putting on eyeshadow just because I want this look to be natural looking. So I'll be moving on to mascara. So I'll be using this Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara. And my mascara has to be waterproof just because super in it. So um, ayoko namang kumalat yung mascara ko. Well, actually yesterday, medyo kumalat siya dito. And hindi ko siya matanggal because I didn't have a Q-tip, but... It's okay. <laughs> Ni naman siya masyado pansin. But like yesterday when I was talking to my friends, they just kept on doing like this to my under eye because may, may kumalat na mascara, but they can't take it off. So okay, so I'm gonna take my curler, which I don't have right now. <laughs> Wait. Okay, so I got my curler. So this one is from the face shop. If you guys are wondering, so I'm just gonna curl my lashes because guys, curling your lashes makes a huge difference. Like, sa everyday makeup ko, I always like to curl my lashes. Which is, I think, not that good. Because yung iba na ubusan ng lashes or yung iba um, napuputula ng lashes. But for me, hindi naman yun ang yayari. So, I'm gonna take my mascara and just apply mascara on my lashes. Ouch! Ah. Ah. Okay, I'm fine. <laughs> hate it when that happens. Oh, diba? Look at the difference. And guys, for this look, I really make sure na maganda yung lashes because I don't have eyeshadow on. Okay, so I'm also gonna apply mascara on my bottom lashes, which is like super hard for me. I don't know why. Kasi lagi siyang nakalat. Oh, there it is. So I'm gonna curl my lashes again. So I'm just gonna do the same thing to the other eye. And by the way, guys, comment down below kung kaka moving up niya lang or kaka graduate niya lang. I make the weirdest face when I'm putting on mascara. <laughs> and guys, so lahat ng mga ABM students, please comment down below some advice because you know I'm gonna take up ABM and I've heard a lot of stories na um, stressful down and then hectic. So please comment down below your experience. Or even though you're not taking up ABM, comment down below if you're taking up STEM or UMS or like any track that you guys have. Para tulong tulong naman tayo. I also have some Bella fam na incoming grade 10 and they keep on asking for advice. So I think the only advice that I can give to you guys is not to cram. <laughs> um, at least for me because nung grade 10 ako, I kept on cramming and procrastinating. That's why super nasa stress ako. And I think this is an unpopular opinion, but for me, um, grade 10 is harder than grade 9. I know, I know, all of you guys have been telling me that no, grade 9 is more stressful than grade 10. But for me, grade 10 is like the most stressful one. Basta guys, time management lang yan. <laughs> okay, now that I'm done with my eyes, now let's move on to cream contour. So this one is from Benefit. This is the Hula Quickie Contour Stick. So I'm just gonna apply this to my cheekbones. Also here. Can you guys see that? Okay, there. Ah, my hair is all over the place. Why? Also here, also on my forehead. Now it's time to blend and I'm using the same sponge. Para naman hindi sayang. Okay, now it's time to set my cream contour with my bronzer. So this is from Physicians Formula. This is their butter bronzer. Take some of this and set my contour. Now it is time for blush and this is like one of my favorite parts when doing my makeup just because nakaka fresh talaga yung blush and that's because I put a lot of blush. <laughs> so this is from Tarte. So this is in the shade 
party. So I'm just taking some of this with my stippling brush and just put it on my cheeks. So it looks like you're blushing, <laughs> but in reality, you're not. <laughs> oh, I really love this blush just because it really complements my skin tone. Now that I'm done with my blush, um, I'm gonna skip highlighter just because feeling ko super makiging oily ako because it's hot like what I said a while ago. So um, my oil is gonna serve as my highlight, <laughs> if you guys know what I mean. So let's skip highlighter. Now let's move on to the lips. So I'm gonna be using two products for my lips. So first, I'm gonna apply this. Lip tint from Etude House. This is their Dear Darling tint in the shade PK004. Okay, that's the shade. <laughs> I'm just gonna put that here and blend. Now it's time for lipstick. So I'll be using this Maybelline lipstick in the shade Clay Crush. So this is a matte lipstick. And I won't really put a lot. I'm just gonna dab. Okay, it is time for the final step, which is to set everything. So I'm going to be using this Milani Make It Last Setting Spray. So that is it for my makeup. Now it is time for the hair. And I won't really do much to my hair. Actually, plan ko dapat na curl siya. Pero I decided not to. <laughs> so I'm just going to part my hair in the middle. Because like, this is the last part of my hair. Ko. Hindi talaga bagay sa akin yung side yung part. So one of my struggles sa hair ko is yung mga nakataas na baby hair. So I'm gonna tame those with this hairspray and a toothbrush. <laughs> this life hack is like all over YouTube so might as well try it out. So I'm just gonna spray some hairspray on the toothbrush. Oops, sala. And I'm just gonna tame those baby hair. Para naman mukhang malinis yung buho ko. And don't worry guys, this is a new toothbrush. <laughs> so yeah, that is it for this graduation slash moving up hair and makeup look. So yeah, that is it for this video. If you guys liked it, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And make sure to subscribe to be part of the hashtag Bella fan and to get notified whenever I upload a new video. Oh, and by the way, I would like to congratulate all the junior high school completers and graduates. I know you guys did a great job. Let's do it again next school year. I'll see you guys in my next video. And don't forget, your That's Bella amazing. Bye!